COVID-19 is caused by a new virus. Although we are learning more about the disease every day, there are a lot of things we still don't know about it. It's normal for people to be afraid of the unknown. However, sometimes we connect our fears to other groups of people. This can lead to groups being treated differently and discriminated against. For example, people who have COVID-19 and people who have recovered from COVID-19, healthcare workers and other frontline workers, and even entire groups and regions can find themselves the target of discrimination. Fear of COVID-19 often makes existing prejudices even worse. This can be very damaging to these people and their families. It can also lead to people hiding signs of the disease or not seeking help when they need it. This makes the virus more likely to spread. Mary is a community-based health worker. She thinks very carefully about the language she uses when talking about COVID-19. She always refers to the virus as COVID-19 and avoids associating the disease with a specific region or group, such as calling it the China virus. Using negative language when talking about COVID-19 can increase people's anxiety. Mary emphasizes the effectiveness of wearing a mask maintaining physical distancing of at least two meters and hand washing. She always reassures people that most people recover from COVID-19. This helps to calm people's fears. Karim lives in a nearby village and a test has confirmed that he has COVID-19. People in the village begin to discriminate against his family. Mary asks the village leader to talk to people about the latest official health advice. She challenges false information when she hears people sharing rumors about Karim's family. Karim recovers at home and once he is well, he and his family return to their normal lives without fear of any more discrimination. By sharing accurate information and countering rumors, Mary helped the whole community to fight COVID-19 together. <music>